Somebody spent an awful lot of money on all these bits of wood and never built the house. So we just spread it out as best we can to give people an idea of the volume of stuff. Hello and welcome back to my office. It is now Thursday and I'm trying to get a bit of a listing done. Um, I've just sorted out this. This is all Tomy uh, Trackmaster track. So that's a box full of track which fits perfectly in that box. Look at that. Excellent. So that is done. So that can be packed away. So that's listed. These are the trains. I bought a big bundle of this at the weekend. I uh, paid a fiver for everything. These I need to go through and work out which ones I'm going to do individually, which ones are working, etc. And also, part of that pickup was this. This is cool. It's like a storage thing. It also has a tunnel going through it and two tunnels here. It should have doors on the front actually, but they, they're missing. Um, and it's got more storage, a whistle. Um, so that I've drafted, I just need to do some pictures for that. So that was a good pickup, um, considering I paid a fiver for everything. That I should get about 20 plus postage. The track is going on at 20 plus postage. And then there should be, I don't know, depends what they're worth, maybe 20, 30 quid's worth of trains there. So I need to find more stuff to list and ideally I need to move some bulk. So I think I'm gonna take a look what's in here. If I perch you up there, does that work, hopefully? So I bought a whole load of um, Doll's House stuff. Um, and it's about time I dealt with it. So I'll get the boxes out um, and we'll take a look. It's all of this up here. This is all bits of wood and wallpaper and all sorts. Yeah, this is all more bits of balsa wood and material. I think this is more of the same. Yeah, so we've got these kits and all sorts. So I'll get this all arranged on the side and we'll have a look through and then I'll do some research and work out how I'm going to sell it. Right, so we've got quite a lot of these kits. Uh, so if I make a stack of those, kitchen, dressing room, dining room, etc. Uh, yeah, bits of wood. Staircase somebody's made. Various bits, a door with door knocker, etc. Just general model making stuff in there. Some more kits. Make a stack. They look like roof tile. Pieces. So these are all sheets for model building. Oh look, parquet flooring under here. This one, I can't get to it. Look at that. Oh, there's another kit. Maybe. Not sure. Uh, these are cut pieces of wood. Oh, that's banisters for a stairway. Interesting. There's loads of it in here. Again, sheets of cut pieces, 
flooring, doors. Oh wow, there's loads and loads of it in here. Right, this is like a whole kit for a house or something. Okay, well that should probably all go together. I mean, I may do the whole lot yet as one big bundle. Um, I think this box is more the same. Yeah, these little pieces of cut wood that you would press out and build furniture by the look of it. Loads of it. The Museum of Dolls Houses. Okay. Yeah, and more of the same in here. So we've got doorways and a plastic. All sorts of bits of wood. Yeah. And the other stuff, the longer stuff, is just bits of wood here, but that has detailing on it. Yeah. Some of this kind of felt grass material. And then some rolls of wallpaper. So I'm going to do a little bit of research, see if it's worth splitting out these kits, maybe do a bundle of those. But the rest of it, I would imagine I will just do one big, like, doll's house model making bundle and lay it out, get lots of pictures. All of these bits and bobs in here, for example, just chuck it all in. Um, I mean, for somebody who's into that and is into building dolls' houses, this will be awesome, right? Hopefully there's a market for it. So I'm going to do a little bit of research, get an idea of how I'm going to do it. Maybe I could do it on auction um, and just see if these have any value. You can see these, the original price there, one ninety nine for that kit, but... Lord only knows how long ago that was. It looks very kind of 1980s even, that. I don't know. This one, 99p. Build a furniture children's bedroom kit. Just very simple press-out pieces. So we'll see if they've got any value as a bundle of those. Before I do the research and look into that stuff, a quick shout out to Ben. A couple of orders have just come in of these Question of Sport cards. So the bundle I had of golf has gone and the last bundle was tennis. So Ben, if you're watching this, thank you. Those will be on their way to you tomorrow. I'm not doing shipping today, that will be Friday. So let's open up eBay and I will see what I can find out. Well, to be perfectly honest, I'm not really finding anything similar. There's lots and lots of bundles of kind of ready-made furniture. These, by the look of it, have very little value, if any. Um, so I just, I've just put it all on my scales. There's a my set of, oh, 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 nearly lost it. It's all sitting on my scales and it comes to over 10 kilos as it is. So what I'm thinking is, I'll break this down into two big bundles maybe, and then just let them go. I don't know whether to do it on auction. I can't really see much on here that's gone on auction. So maybe I just come up with a price for two lots. Maybe do one lot of all of the, um, the kits as such and then one bundle of everything else that would seem to make sense i just need to get rid of it um we picked this up at a jumble trail um we bought loads of stuff from one store right at the end of the day there were board games there was i can't even remember loads and loads of it some ceramics so yeah it owes me very little and it's big and bulky 
and in the way. So I need to make decisions and get this done today. So I'm just going through it all. And I think a lot of this is like a periodical thing. So you would build a doll's house over time. So this look is part 12 in this issue, back wall of ground floor left. So I think a lot of this is just collected up issues. See, here's another one. In this issue, flower pots for the main entrance. So that would make sense. So it's kind of a couple of boxes of those periodical issues to build a house. Interesting. So it feels like I should keep, keep it all together, or most of it, because it's going to be a kit to build a house. Whether it's complete or not, who knows? Yeah, the deeper I get into this box, you can see that they've just labelled each part. So in this issue, bedroom wardrobe one, another issue there, and it carries on. So in this issue, bathroom wall. So whether somebody could piece this together and actually make a house out of it, who knows, but it all needs to stay together, um, is the thought at the moment. The other thing that's just become clear is how much money somebody spent on this. So this was number 72, so this part of the kit, and that's 395. So if you do the maths, somebody spent an awful lot of money on all these bits of wood and never built the house. Right, so all of the stuff that I think is to do with that model making kit to build a house is now in these two boxes. And that now with the boxes weighs just over nine kilos, 9.3 kilos approximately. So I'm gonna keep all of that together and sell it as doll's house model making kit. Don't know if it's complete. Look at the pictures, see what you get, make up a price. And the other bits are just these. I'm gonna do those as a little bundle. Won't be much value in it, but that then keeps this lot under 10 kilos is the idea. So that's gonna be the plan. I think what I'll do next is spread all of this out so I can get a load of pictures done and then just get a listing made up. Right, so the model kits are just like that. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's that little bundle. Get a couple of pictures of that. Right, so I've laid out the rest of it. So this is all of the kit parts that, that make up a doll's house. Um, so we just spread it out as best we can to give people an idea of the volume of stuff. Now, as I said before, I don't know if this is a complete kit. It's just gonna be sold as seen, doll's house, parts, model making, bundle, and uh, see how we get on. So I'm gonna snap a load of pictures of this, um, draft a listing, and come up with an idea of price. So hopefully we will get a buyer for that and we'll get it out of the office. Anyway, I hope that was interesting. If you are new to this channel, uh, welcome for a start. Uh, please think about subscribing. Um, on this channel, we talk about all aspects of how we earn a living, buying and selling all of this stuff you see around me in here on the internet. If that sounds like something you'd be interested in, please subscribe, it is free. And I will leave you with another one of our videos up here. So please check this one out. Take care and I'll see you soon. Bye.